In fact, if you think about it, one God in Islam is a problem. Why? Okay, if you see this Abdul, he speak about, supposedly he is trying to debunk the, the atheist. He say, everything have a creation, is a creator. He have a video there. Everything have a creator. He's, he spoke about, actually about Google. Imagine he is comparing his God to Google. So Google, you know, but if everything, this is your logic, everything have a creator, will that mean your God have a creator too? Either you go with a theory to the end, or you don't go with the theory. So we Christians, we don't believe in God because just everything have a creator. No. This is not the reason, because if you believe everything have a creator, then God himself have a creator. If your theory is nothing can come by itself, and this is the theory, nothing can come to existence by itself, well, that means God, the one you're your ship, cannot come to existence by itself. So the Muslims, they are hypocrite. They created a theory, but they cannot go to the end. They arrive to Allah and they stop. But you just said nothing can be created by itself. Are you with me, guys? Do you understand what I'm saying? So when they want, they go by a theory. And when they want, they stop the theory. When they want, they go by logic. And when they want, they stop the logic. Is it logical that Allah have a son? The Muslim, they will say no. Okay, why no? Because it does not be fit to Allah to have a son. Why? If you have a son, that will make him bad, Allah? <laughs> Do you see what I'm talking about? They are just hypocrite liars. They don't know what they are talking about. When this guy himself, he said, if God enter his creation, he cannot be God. He said that, right? And then two days after, he says, Allah enter his creation. So what we learn from this, the Muslim logic is stupid. The Muslim, they change their answer depend on the situation. Which means they have no answer for anything. They are hypocrite liars. So if he is debating, uh, you know, when a Muslim, he speak to a black African American, what he would say to him, do you know what the white Christians did to you and your parents and your grandfather? And then the black guy would say, yeah, you know, they took us as a slave. Yeah, yeah, you know, see, brother, in Islam, we are, Islam is for everybody. But they will not tell him that the prophet, he have thousands of black slaves. They will not tell him that the prophet used to rape those slaves. I saw a video of a Muslim speaking about, he was speaking in a city hall. He said, the one who built the city hall, he used to be a slave owner. But is it your prophet, the biggest slave owner? Not only that, one of his title is the one who sell and buy slaves. So Islam is not a religion. It's not a fixed answers. Islam is the bend they are speaking to who? Because they are devilish. If a Muslim want to speak to a homosexual, how he speak to homosexual? They make a website saying the prophet used to put eyeliner. The prophet uh, used to be a gay. The prophet, the caliphate, he approved the first imam, he was a gay. Just convert them to Islam. And then after they convert, they try to convince them to stay away from homosexuality. There's a story in, in YouTube, I can look for it. And obviously it's a fabricated story. But Muslims always, they claim their stories is nothing to do with fabrication. So supposedly in the story, there was a, was a guy, he, his neighbor is a Jew. And the Muslim guy keeps saying to the Jew, why you don't convert to Islam?
the Jew he says, well, I like to smoke. Look at the reason. I mean, why why the Jews he don't why the Jews cannot convert to Islam because he want to smoke. <laughs> I like to drink. Uh, silly, stupid story. And then the Muslim said to him, "Who said to you you cannot smoke and drink? You can." The Jew, he said to him, really? He said, yeah, absolutely. Just take Shahada. Then the Jewish guy, he took the Shahada according to the YouTuber st story, the Sheikh. After he took the Shahada, the Muslim said to him, listen, brother, now you become a Muslim. You cannot drink. Otherwise, we will punish you. He said, but you just told me, you just told me a minute ago that I can. He said, yeah, at that moment, I meant at that moment, at that moment, you can drink. But now you are a Muslim. That's it. You cannot. So they even they are proud about deception. They try to convert you by deception. They have no dignity. They have no God. They have zero ethic. This is what they do with women too. They go on the internet, they swarm the internet, they want to get a green card, they want to go get a visa, they want to come to America, they want to come to France, they want to come to England, they want to come anywhere. He find the woman, she is old, nobody is talking to her, she is lonely. He texts her, he is 20 years old, she is 65, 70. And then, honey, you are so beautiful. And you, oh my God, you look so good. And this 70 woman, she looked like this 20 years old boy, he is worshipping her. Oh, wow, look at you, so beautiful. You know, I told my parents about you. Really, you want, what, you want to marry me? Really? You know, she married him, she gave him a green card. He, you know, after he got, ah, Baba, you think you're an idiot, I'm going to marry you in the age of my mother. He got the green card. In fact, Mimi Hijab himself, Mimi Hijab himself. He gave us an example of what the Muslim practice in Europe. They go and they marry a woman for a few hours for sex and for papers. Is it the Christian prince who said that? This is Mimi Hijab himself. Watch it. All you're happy to do, you and your friends, yeah, is acquiesce to the fact that you guys are going around yeah, marrying people for two minutes and three minutes and five minutes and one hour, two hours, whatever it may be. Selfies are always accused marriage and divorce. Marriage Did you divorce, hear? Marriage. What? How, how, how much? How? You're happy to do, you and your friends. Yeah, it's acquiesce to the fact that you guys are going around. Yeah, marrying people for two minutes and three minutes and five minutes and one hour, two hours, whatever it may be. Selfies are always accused marriage. Those are two Muslim groups accusing of each other of what they do. They marry women for two minutes, three minutes, five hours, maybe. Do you and your friends, yeah? It's acquiesce to the fact that you guys are going around, yeah, marrying people for two minutes and three minutes and five minutes and one hour. Here you see the Mimi Hijab, the bully. He, he's lying, obviously. Muslim, they marry uh, for a short time, just for the sake of sex or just for papers, but two minutes. Who in the world want to believe in such a garbage, this guy, he said? Can we trust what this man is saying? Have you ever heard of a human being? He marry a woman for two minutes. I mean, if you are a rabbit, it will take you longer to finish it. It will take you longer to take off your pant. Two minute Mimi Hijab. So those Muslims, one of the practice lifestyle of Islam and Muslims, they bully, they are a bully. This is the culture and the religion of the bully. The second one of them oppose the other one, they start bullying the man. It's a bully bully cult. 
So now he decided to bully them. Maybe they marry a woman for a day, two, three hours, five hours, but two minutes. Himimi Hijab, are you really so fast? Like, are you the kind who finish it before you start it? Are you saying to me that Muslims, they have so fast erection before the infection? Before even the injection? Before any action? I'm stuck with Shen now. What the heck is that? Those are the Muslims. So those Muslims, they insult each other. They call each other names. You know, I mean, what a, what a hilarious cult. What a hilarious cult. This is not a religion. Is it? Oh boy. Uh, so do we have any Abdul here? Any Abdul would like to join us in Skype? Maybe, maybe. Sure not. They are potatoes. Cowards like their prophet. A man at the age of 54, he is after a girl, she is six years old, which means five in our calendar. And yet they claim that this is, was halal. And she was horny. At that time, at that time, women, they are so horny. At that time, at that time, Aisha, she was even engaged to someone else before Muhammad. At that time, at that time, I mean, you know, and not only that, they go farther and they say that uh, 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 Rebecca, she married Isaac and she was uh, three years old. And then they bring you a video of a pervert uh, rabbi, obviously he's a stupid, and he say, yeah, she, you know, she was, obviously. But in fact, if you go and read the Hebrew, the Bible, you will see that the girl, which is Rebecca, called Alama, which mean young women. She is a young woman as a virgin. She is a young woman as a virgin. She's a virgin. She's a young woman. And she's not a child. This is what Alama mean. In fact, I, I played a video of this guy's come back to weave a singer. Hey, Lili Dawa, how come the Muslim they praise uh, to weave a singer who say that the Virgin Mary story is a lie and this is not Jesus? But you Muslim don't get upset. You get upset only from Ben Shapiro? Potatoes. But anyway, I find that the purpose of this video my, by Lili Dawa is to divide us with the Jews so they can divide and conquer. And I want to finish this with my video.